you and I were talking about this before we even started. That John Kent Adventures of Superman book is coming down the pipeline. You and mm-hmm. I are very excited about that. Mm-hmm. We're excited about the blue suit. John yes. looks really good in it. We're excited for new electric powers. Yeah. Uh, it, it looks like, uh, what is it, Val Zod is going to be in that because there's yes. like a whole dimension hopping aspect. Yep. But another thing that Tom Taylor just announced is, hey, you thought Val Zod was the only guest Superman. Nope. Get ready for the return. And technically first, maybe second, depending on how you count it, canon introduction of Injustice Superman. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, depend. Yeah, depending on which crises uh, are uh, are like canon, 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 canon now, uh, this could technically be his first. Yeah, because if you remember in Convergence, I believe it was they showed us the Injustice Universe just to blow it up, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and that's technically the first and maybe only time we actually saw that universe to be like, no, no, it exists. And then they blew it up, which seemed very petty at the time, didn't it? Yeah, I, and I don't think like convergence counts anymore. That's there's no. several several crises ago. Yeah, who even knows? Although I, I will say on this one, uh, Tom Taylor certainly got the last laugh, didn't he? He did. Yeah, yeah. It, it's great. <laughs> it, it's funny too because you know before this series started, when I knew that it was going to be dimension hopping, I'm like, oh, I bet it's only a matter of time before John eventually has to fight Ultraman and Earth Three because you know that's such a big part of his character right now and he's got to go back and face that and he's got to deal with that wouldn't it be interesting if they completely sidestep that and they're like no the evil superman that john has to overcome it is injustice superman actually yeah well i imagine that's going to be part of like the big issue but like i know ultraman is the overarching villain because he's the one going Mm. through multiverses killing superman off for for some reason yeah yeah we know that now yeah yeah he he revealed that uh yeah it's, it's been him killing the supermen Okay, that's pretty cool. Is yeah. it is it to feed his kryptonite addiction? Is that why? Probably. And again, this is like Ultraman. He probably wants to be the only Superman around, you know. Makes sense. He is a narcissist and everything. Man, yeah. that'd be fun to, to have, you know, Ultraman come face to face with a Superman who might actually be more evil than him. <laughs> well, what's, it, what's the interesting in, about that as well is that obviously Injustice kicked off because of the death of Superman's son. Like this yes, is that's, that's the, right. the entire reason why this universe oh, started shit. the way it did. So like, how does introducing him into this story work? Because I think oh, wow. Tom also said that this is going to take place during year five, which is like at this point, Superman's a lost cause. He's fucking evil, you know. Interesting. Wow, that's fascinating. To have this Superman be like, "Oh, you're the son I lost. You know, everything mm. would have been different if you had lived." Yeah. Wow, that's really something interesting. Wow, wouldn't, wouldn't it be something of injustice? Superman is like, I'll protect you from Ultraman, but also I'm worse, just so you know. <laughs> Will he protect him from Ultraman, though? Like, that, that's the thing. Um, that, that's a great juxtaposition, too, because Ultraman's like, no, I was born evil because my world is fucked up and because morality is inverted. You started as a good Superman, but lost your way and became irredeemable at a point yeah yeah may, maybe like ultraman and end, ends up being like the good guy in this situation wow that would be nuts yeah that would be insane yeah to have john be like look you know i don't blame ultraman because everything is fucking topsy-turvy in his universe up is down black is white in is out you started as my dad but just kept making bad choice after bad yeah. choice yeah yeah you could have easily like stopped all of this really quickly but you didn't but you didn't you had choices that you didn't make huh Wow, that's that's going to be really interesting. I think that's uh, it, it was always going to be a must buy for you and me, but now I think it's officially a must buy for everybody. Definitely, <laughs> definitely. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, what else?